Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. Welcome, welcome to our home and welcome to ch chapter worship. Yeah. Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, from my side, welcome to chapter worship. <laughs> it's just a platform that we use. Just invite those yeah. into our homes, sure. far and wide. Because that is the gathering of the saints that the Bible speaks to not neglect. Yeah. And so as a family, we are so privileged and honored this afternoon to just do that with our guests as well as those online. Yeah, that's true. So we got together as um, the chapters um, and we have some guests here. They're looking at me with big eyes, but yeah, they are our guests um, that we'll introduce to you a little bit later. Yes. And you'll probably see them through, through and, and, and the shots. So this afternoon or today, um, or when you're looking, whether you're watching the very broadcast of this, um, we'd like to just, as Candice said, invite you into our home um, for a time of worship. And that's exactly it. Um, yes. Using every form um, and means to get the word of God um, to everybody willing to listen to the nations. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm just reminded in COVID, it was a time that it was very sad for many yeah. um, but there was also so many other opportunities that was birthed during this that season sure, of uncertainty. Sure. And Jafta worship was a ministry birthed in COVID. I think you want to say Jafta shenanigans every time, huh? I keep on wanting to say Jafta shenanigans because it also intertwines. But for this, for the sake of this um, session, it is Jafta worship. And what we did in, in lockdown was we took an opportunity in a time that yeah. the world, worldwide, experienced the similar uncertainty at the same time. 100%. And it was those moments that we thought, what, what can we do as a family for the kingdom of God to still be advanced in this time that we needed Him more than ever? Um, because God wants us to need Him even when we are enduring good times. For sure. To not only want Him when it's bad times, but this is pretty much chapter worship that we have now yeah. birth. And God, we give God all the glory and honor because it's all about Him. Yeah. So we are just the servants and the mouthpieces of God. And we have vowed as a family to, to be just that and give him all the glory and honor. Yeah, so, so this is the beginning of, 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 of much more to come. Yes. Um, so, so we're just going to ask that you, that you remain um, connected. Um, and prayful for and us. And prayful. Please keep us in your prayers. Um, this is the beginning, the first of so, so much more that God has laid on our hearts as a family. For sure. Um, so... Yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna um, prolong it. Prolong it and so um, try and sell it to you, but but God's will be done, and that's that's Amen. our prayer of our hearts always as a family and those that we come into contact with, that God's will will always be done Amen. in whatever we do. And so my scripture I just want to leave with you right now is it comes from Isaiah 43 verse 11, verse 12 and it says, First I predicted your rescue, then I saved you and proclaimed it to the world. No foreign God has ever done this. You are witnesses that I am the only God, says the Lord. And I want to go down to, the, to verse 19 that is our family scripture for the season we find ourselves in. It says, for I am about to do something new. See, I have already begun. Do you not see it, says the Lord? I will make a pathway through the wilderness. I will create rivers in the dry wastelands. And that is a scripture we as a family are forever holding on to in this season because it truly is a new season and God is truly doing something brand new in and through our lives and our ministry. And so we give God all the honor and glory. And with that scripture, I'd like to just bless you with the following word, song. Just listen to the words and make it your own. Because you will make a way for me and you. God make a way where there seems to be no way. He works in ways we cannot see. Listen 
to this part. By the world we in the world and us, he leads me. Rivers in the desert will I see. God, you'll make a way just for you. Amen.